YouTube, sitting here in my office, bored, not doing anything today, so reached in my pocket and grabbed my knife a minute ago, and I thought, man, I ain't made a video on that, and that's something else that I, I utilize on a daily basis, uh, for those of you who read the title. And anybody who just knows the knives, this is the uh, Chinese made out the front lightning, and uh, I think I give 40 bucks for it. Ordered it off the internet about a year ago. And uh, as you can tell, it's double action, automatic out the front, and it retracts automatically. And uh, I've used the, the heck out of this knife. I've used it for everything, you know, just working. Daily, uh, daily, you know, normal mundane stuff, opening the mail, Amazon boxes cutting rope at work, cutting into plastic, wood, you name it. I mean, I've even uh, used it for some light stabbing. And, of course, I, I play. I find myself playing with it often, too. Uh, keep your mind out of the gutter. And about the only thing that I've done with this is, um, you can see there the pocket clip. I have used the pocket clip on this. Uh, and it is bent out just slightly and these two screws here they did work their way loose uh, fairly fairly soon after getting it honestly uh, but I just kept tightening them down and then one day I finally got smart and backed them out of there and put a little bit of Loctite on them and I haven't had an issue out of them since they've been snug as a bug in the road and the uh, knife just keeps doing its thing. It's never once failed. Never never failed to open, never failed to close. I've had lint jammed in there, uh, dirt, mud, you name it. And it, it just keeps doing its thing. Well worth 40 bucks. And uh, you, you might, you know, before you go, go uh, clicking on that mouse too fast to order you one if you don't already have one, you might want to check into your your uh, local laws there uh, automatic knives like this a lot of times are considered illegal however if you are a CCW holder and your state permits it such as mine um, it is legal to carry an automatic knife if you have a CCW license which I do so just something to consider before you go buying it but uh, even if you don't want to pack it it's just a really cool knife to keep at the house there um, and it has a little feature built into it so if you try to shoot it out and stab something it just jumps off the track and then uh, if you want to get it back on track it's that simple it just drops right back on the track and it keeps doing its thing uh, well worth 40 bucks and despite it being made in China and being made fairly cheap for what it is it's uh, it's been a really good knife I had to add some hydraulic fluid to uh, to my piece of equipment the other day and I was kind of leery but I went ahead and jabbed that into the uh, top of the five, gallon, uh, five gallon bucket there to let it breathe while I pulled, poured the fluid out and it penetrated just fine stayed locked never uh, never give me any issues so once it's locked out I believe it's actually you know solid enough to handle most tasks of course if you're gonna do any sort of hardcore stabbing you definitely want a knife that's that's uh, better suited for for stabbing but uh, for what it is it's well worth 40 bucks I, like I said I, I definitely use this and carry it every single day well worth it guys so that's the down and dirty on the lightning hope you guys are having a good day peace